Hey, Pascal. Uh, when uh, you when Nick rolled out the starting lineup and you guys were going small and in theory, I guess your center. I don't know. Um, you know, does that change your mindset at all uh, when you're looking? It's you and Norm and OG all playing together for once. Uh, I mean, it's different. Um, I don't think that happened this year. Um, might be wrong. I don't know. But um, but yeah, like it, it's different. But I think just because of our personnel and, and the team that we have, you know, we kind of all know that at any time, you know, anything can happen. So um, we just got to be ready um, for it and, and, and it, try to execute the game plan. And, and I think, which we, which I think we did tonight. So it's good. I would, I would assume offensively, it feels pretty comfortable, but defensively, do you kind of sometimes look around and, you know, you're matched up with Lopez or you're matched up with, I mean, you match up with Giannis regularly, but you kind of want, wish there might be a, a bigger body out there to, to help. Sure. Uh, I mean, it, it is what it is. Um, you know, I think for me, I think the most, like the hardest thing, especially a guy like uh, Lopez, I mean, he's more like a perimeter type of type of big, whereas like, you know, um, the only thing you kind of like have to really worry about is like boxing him out and stuff. You know, he's he's a presence down there. Um, and, and I think that's the, 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 the challenge, you know, and, but, you know, I think there's some other bigs, like, you know, we played, when we played like Giannis, uh, Varenchino's where it's like, okay, you know, it's going to be in the pain every second. And, and, you know, um, so there's different type of bigs, but I think, you know, for the most part, man, like it's, it's gotta be a team effort and, um, you know, we know we're on the size, but, um, we just gotta go out there and get the job done. Thanks, Pascal. Have a good night. We will go to Eric Kareen next. Hey, Pascal, um, mm -hmm. there's a, you guys obviously haven't been, you know, happy with your record this year, even though there's been a lot of good play, but then you look at the team you're playing tonight and the, now they've lost four in a row. Really, there's only a few teams who you could say have been consistently good this season. Do you think there's something special about this season that's making it so like there's, there's so little consistency in terms of that top tier of teams? Uh, I mean, I, I didn't know. I didn't know that it was they lost four games until you told me. But, um, but again, I mean, I, I wouldn't be surprised. I think it's it's been you know it's been crazy. I, I, I think we 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 all gotta kind of like agree with it. It's, it's been um, a crazy year. A lot of things happening, and 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 I mean, you gotta give credit to all the teams too. Like, there's not teams out there every single night. I will go out there to try to win games and. Um, they don't really care, you know, what's your record or what you did in the past. And, and I mean, I think at the end of the day, it's just about basketball. And um, uh, we, we can all talk about what's happening because it is it is happening. It's a, yeah. it's a weird year and this is crazy. But at the same time, we can also give credit to all the teams, like just going out there every single night trying to win games, no matter who it is, who is, who is in front of them. And, um, you know, so I think that's what it is. Fred sort of said, uh, you know, wins like this don't necessarily prove that you're as good as you say you are. Like you, what you guys need to do is string them together. Uh, what do you think is the key to sort of doing that and putting together a stretch of six or eight games where you're playing um, that type of basketball? Yeah, I think that's that's like like you said. I think that's right. We we got to be able, you know. I think good teams win, you know, uh, consistently and, and they win games in a row. Um, and and I think we've been super close in, in doing that. You know, a little bit on on, on consistency, um, but. Um, yeah, I agree with him. We, we got to be able to uh, swing a couple wins, especially against good teams, because um, because that's kind of like what what shows like what type of team you are, like what's your character. And then obviously playing a team like that, like you know, a really good team twice, you know, they're gonna make adjustments. We got to make adjustments, and I think it's a, it's, a, it's just like a good uh, matchup and, and a good time to have that type of challenge. Thanks, Pascal. Good game. Have a good night. Thank you. Next question will go to Josh Lewenberg. Hey, Pascal, you, you spoke about the small lineup and some of the different types of lineups that Nick has experimented with and can continue to experiment with. How much do you think OG unlocks that ability for you guys as a team with his versatility and his ability to do different things on both ends of the floor? Um, yeah, I think, you know, he's, he's definitely a big piece. And, and um, having him out there also, you know, on defense, you know, there's a lot more switching that we can do, um, knowing that he can hold up, you know, some of the bigs and, and you know, guard – the guards on the perimeter. Um, so there's just a lot that we can do uh, as a team. Um, his, his versatility um, as a defender, you know, definitely help us. And I think the more guys like that that we have, um, the better our small lineup could work because we can, you know, we can do a lot of different things.
Great. Thanks, Pascal. Have a good night, man. Thanks, Josh. I'll wrap up with Mike from Le Express. Bonsoir Pascal, félicitations pour le bon match, le très bon match et la belle performance collective et individuelle. Je voulais te demander, est-ce qu'on peut parler de victoire référence ce soir ah Bon, je pense que, comme je dis toujours, je pense qu'avec notre record et, tout, et les matchs qu'on a eu, et les matchs qu'on a gagnés ou qu'on pouvait gagner, je pense que toute victoire est, est, est une bonne victoire pour nous. Et, 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 et aussi, comme l'a dit, tout, tout, toutes les équipes viennent avec... avec euh, l'espoir de gagner et il, il joue euh, peu importe l'équipe qu'il qui, qui rencontre donc euh, je pense pour nous on doit juste euh, se focaliser à euh, euh, essayer de gagner des matchs mais pas seulement un match mais, 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 mais plus de matchs voire deux trois quatre cinq matchs euh, de, de suite donc euh, je pense que c'est notre objectif et à la fin bon on, quand tu gagnes contre une bonne équipe c'est, c'est bien mais euh, on, on les joue encore dans deux jours et c'est un nouveau challenge et je pense que pour nous c'est important c'est de, de jouer à notre niveau de manière consistante. Justement, c'était ça ma deuxième question. Vous avez manqué de régularité pour l'instant dans ce début de saison, mais tu l'as un peu dit en anglais, c'est un peu tout le monde. Est-ce que vous avez un peu analysé ça et vous avez commencé à trouver les solutions pour gagner en régularité justement ouais, Je pense que bon, quand tu regardes des matchs qu'on a perdus, c'est, c'est, c'est un, c'est deux points, c'est un, un panier ici, un panier là-bas. Donc, euh, euh, je pense qu'on n'est on on est pas trop loin, mais, mais, mais à la fin, je pense que c'est, c'est juste euh, attention aux, aux détails et, 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 et euh, juste avoir euh, euh, ce petit plus un peu là, que, qu'on a besoin donc, euh, pendant les matchs où on est, on est proche, mais, mais on n'arrive pas à gagner. Donc, euh, euh, et puis, c'est, c'est toute la ligue, tout le monde, tout le monde dans la ligue euh, essaie de gagner, tout, 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 tout le monde joue. Certaines équipes jouent bien, certaines équipes ne jouent pas bien. Donc, euh, à la fin, juste la concentration et essayer d'être en équipe et avoir juste ce petit plus-là qui aide à gagner des matchs.